Hi everyone, in this video we will simplify higher roots. Simplify the third root of negative 216. The third root, or the cube root, means that I'm multiplying something by itself three different times. Let's go ahead and make a list of cubes. One cubed is one times one times one, which is one. Two cubed is eight. Three cubed is 27. Four cubed is 64. 5 cubed is 125, 6 cubed is 216. However, in this list we'll see that all of the answers are positive, so let's go ahead and try these as a negative. If I have a negative 1 cubed, this means that I have negative 1 times negative 1 times negative 1. And where negative 1 times negative 1 is positive, and a positive then times a negative equals a negative one. This means that all of these cubes, if I change them to be a negative, will be a negative answer. Because a negative times a negative is positive, and then that resulting positive times the last negative will equal a negative. So if I put this negative in for every single one of these, then I end up with a negative here, and that then tells me that negative 6 cubed equals negative 216. So I can even write it negative 6 cubed. And the cube root negates the cube, which gives us the answer of negative 6. Or you can just say that the cube root of negative 6, 216 is negative 6. Either way you uh, want to go about it or think about it, the answer is negative 6, and we're all done.